So we got a new president, man. Yeah, no Got question. a new president. Got Donald Trump in the house. No doubt. In the White House. And, um, man, what's your thoughts on that? I mean, my thought is it's, it's kind of funny to me because I'm looking at how scared everybody getting. You know, black folks and Latino folks, they, they scared to death. So when I see that, I'm like, okay, well, if you're getting that scared and nervous behind a politician being placed in office, then you don't have the belief in a God that you claim you have. Because if you're a Christian or Muslim or whatever it is you claim, and you're worried about some dude in office, man, then your, your faith ain't as strong as you claim it is. You know, I mean, I, I honestly believe that. But can't you have faith and still believe that you got a, 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 a kook in the house, you know, like just a fool? Yeah, you can believe it because he is a fool, but you shouldn't be scared of him. You shouldn't be scared of anything that he Not scared of him, do, but scared of what he could what possibly do. do. Yeah, yeah, and, and, but you shouldn't fear that. You know, at the end of the day, I, part of my belief is that God places circumstances in, in order to make us get right. You know, for years you got black people that we, not, you, we haven't united, we haven't pooled our resources, we haven't established businesses for, of our own, and we always seeking to integrate and, and rub elbows with white folks and get next to them. And his waiting on them to pass or something down. Nothing, right. Right. But when the, when the heat get up under you, if he puts the kind of heat up under us that, that most people believe he's going to put up under us, it's going to force us to unite. You mm -hmm. know, so... You know, I believe that that's that's a plan that could. Well, be hell, I like him then. I, well, if you're gonna put it like that, look, and, 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 and Donald the, Trump, do your thing, man. Dog us out, do us wise, dirty. And the wise people among us <laughs> I mean, think I want, the way you I'm think. Ready. Like, come on with it. Some yeah. people are glad because um, they're looking at the bigger picture. The bigger picture is us coming together as a people and getting out from under the foot of America. You mm -hmm. know, and if we can pull that off. By any means, we got to take some stripes, and we got to get whapped across the ass a few times to get right. Then so be it, straight up. Yeah, but you know, Donald Trump ain't just scaring black folks; he's scaring the international community. Like, I remember it was a distinct, dis, dis, uh, uh, that was a distinct difference in how people perceive the president elect uh, versus how they perceive. Uh, President Obama, once he became uh, president, or even before he became president of the United States, when he was running, I, I was traveling. You know, I do a lot of traveling, so abroad. And majority of people were rooting for Barack Obama right. abroad. Right. This is the international community. Right. They wanted Obama to be in office, right. um, not McCain. This time around, the, the international community was hoping that Hillary Clinton got in. And I understand people say, you know, Hillary Clinton, oh, man, she's a devil. She's just like the rest of them. And, you know, Hillary calling her Hillary and all this yeah. type of stuff. I use that it's the left. Myself. Yeah, it's, it's the lesser <laughs> of two evils. Yeah. And, I, and I understand all of that stuff. But, man, people are shaking their, their boots about Donald yeah. Trump because, you know what, he made some statements that somebody posted next to statements that Hitler made. Yeah. And man, they were eerily similar. Right, 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 right. So when you start thinking about what Hitler was able to do and right. how people just totally disregarded, because when you think about when I when I really think about Hitler, and I and I and I and I like I, when I read his uh, the, the autobiography of Hitler and all mm -hmm. that stuff, and I read stuff about Hitler, he didn't seem like that smart of a dude to me. Right. He really just seemed like a like a off dude. He right. seemed like he was off. He was, was something missing. Yeah. He was thrown off. It was something missing in his life. Yeah. And he was, he just had the prowess to get to that point to where yeah. he could convince people to follow him. Right. Right. You know, you don't have to be like an intellect. No, you to be able to you do that. You got to be charismatic. You got to be charismatic. That, exactly. The pool. You know, some guys they they not just the smartest guy in the world, but they have a pull, an attracting right. power on the people. And, 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 and that's sometimes that's all you need. Right.